Antonio. The, uh, the ability to serve any corner. A little bit more spin and margin on her ground strokes. Venus with the flatter sh shots. Well, oh, she's using that serve very effectively tonight. It seems like. So it's a break for Serena, 4-1 in the first. Back in Miami at the Sony Erickson Open, where these two sisters from the great champions have combined Go. to win this event, this prestigious event, eight times. The other name uh, all went out early. The Williams sisters got through to really for this marquee match. Very start of this match, still not moving at a hundred percent, trying to end the points a little bit quicker. Yeah, well, I hate to be the Grim Reaper down here, but it's exactly what we feared. The exact opposite vibe so right now in this crowd in oh, courtside yeah, last night with the Roddick Federer match just totally captivating this crowd. It just seems to be a state of confusion out here at the moment. been at a fair number of these matches I've never seen one that wasn't like this I think most fans now understand how difficult it is for the sisters to play each other and it just transfers everyone realizes how conflicted this is they're conflicted that's, you know. and that's the, the right the essence is there's no rooting interest Any great competition has a foil, and there's no foil out here. Roth and Roger were assured that if they played, it was going to be for a final, for a championship. Okay. So we know yes. And Serena with a hold and love, so she's now a game from the first so set. Second serves in this set. Still in trail position, but she's won eight of ten second serve points. Oh. Trying to attack with Venus. Justin, come on. That's your serve to jump in on. It seems like Venus serves a lot of body serves more on missed locations, not necessarily that she's always aiming it there. I remember and her most painful body serve was on match point at Wimbledon in 05. Serving right into the hip of Lindsay Davenport, setting up that short inside out backhand. <laughs> There's some collateral damage to that one. Leave it to Justin. Sometimes memory's not a good thing, is it? <laughs> That's what my psychiatrist says. Oh! 
15. Love. spin on the ball. Venus hits the ball much flatter and with much more pace and this is where she's so dangerous. She takes that backhand early, really sets herself up for this forehand and while we pick on her forehand, it definitely is a strong shot when she's inside the baseline and moving forward. Forehand, there's, there's a, a, a great column it, written it, in, the, it, in the London Times during Wimbledon last summer, where they have a tendency to write in ways that we Americans mostly can only dream of. But it was a, a great line after this point about Venus's forehand. It said, the writer said, Venus's forehand is rather like a horse I used to ride. Beautiful, immensely powerful, and ever so slightly uncontrollable. Dangerous to both opposition and owner. And there, Venus in a game where she was able to use that forehand. Gets the break back. For the moment, denies Serena the first set. It was a big night at the Sony Ericsson Open. Venus Williams just, after making no dent at all on Serena's serve, only in one game, able to get that break. Really picked up the pace and the consistency of her forehand. She was the aggressor in that game, and that's where Venus Williams wants to be in this match, inside the baseline going for her shots and she'll hit a few errors that way but definitely wants to hit them when she's the aggressor. They're not used to that in match situations. Right. They're used to that it's in practice with each other but very few girls stand inside the baseline to return their serve on a consistent basis. That's what's fascinating to watch. Neither has yielded much in that regard to the other. The second serves in particular, here comes Serena. 